To write the formula for mercury-1 fluoride, we need to realize that this mercury-1, it's a bit of an exception. So when you see mercury-1 here, this is what you need to be thinking. You can kind of think about mercury-1 as a polyatomic ion, Hg2, 2 plus. Each one of the mercury atoms, that's going to be 1 plus, because we have two of them. But we find this overall Hg2, 2 plus. So we have our mercury-1 here, and then for fluoride, that's fluorine on the periodic table. Fluorine forms ions that are 1 minus. So we need to have these charges balanced. This is a neutral compound. It doesn't say ion after it. If we had two of the fluoride ions, 2 times 1 minus, that would balance out the 2 plus, give us a net charge of 0. So this is the formula for mercury 1 fluoride, Hg2F2. If you were given this formula and asked to write the name for Hg2F2, you know that fluorine is 1 minus. And since you have two of them, it's 2 minus. So each one of the mercury ions has to be 1 plus. That's why we call it mercury 1. This is Dr. B with the formula for mercury 1 fluoride. Thanks for watching.